Welcome back everybody, I'm Brad. I'm Jessica. And today we have a beer that Jessica picked out. And also, before we start, I want to say we're trying a different setup today. So, I want you guys to let us know if you like it or if we should go back to the old way. If you could see our wrinkles. <laughs> so, Jessica's going to talk about it and I will pour. I don't really know anything about this beer. Um, it is uh, from Brewery Vivent. I hope I said that right. Um, it's it's a tropical saison, and I believe I said that right. Um, I bought it actually at the the corner grocery store um, by where I work because the can looked appealing, the colors <laughs> of the can. Um, but I did read it, right? And um, it talks about sunshine. It has flamingos, so I'm not exactly sure, you know, how you could go wrong there. But it's a pineapple and mango tropical saison. I believe that's saison. Saison. Okay, it's five for five point five percent alcohol. Um, it talks about sunscreen and doing grass. Um, so I just, you know, it's another one of. I thought it looked appealing. I read the label. I don't, I believe you've tried some brewery Vivint. It's Vivint Brewery is what it is. <laughs> okay. All right. <laughs> um, but it's, um, but you've had some. I don't, yeah. I don't remember what ones yeah, you've I, had. Yeah, they've been about a year ago, I would say. And it's only been like one or two, so yeah. it's not. Well, I was going to say, I didn't, I didn't remember yeah. if they were good or bad. Um, but they're Michigan ones, and this is tier two specialty release. So. Right. You know, I, I'm i always willing to try it. And again, I went by what the can looked like, and we know how my record is with that. So let's, yeah, and let's... we don't know the IBUs. They are not on the can, and they are not on the site from what I could find. Also, they're not on Untap. That's all the places I looked, so okay. they could be there. So as we've been talking, head has died down just a little bit. We got about a half a finger. Mine looks good and crisp yep. still. Medium, small bubbles on there. White head. Frothy. Yep. I would say frothy. Yep. You're okay. getting some more peaks than I am. Yep. Cloudy. I do have some chunks in mine. <laughs> I would say, what color? Like a lemon? Yes. Lemon color? Yep. You cannot see through it. It no. is hazy. I do see some bubbles coming up, though, that are close to my side of the glass. Okay. Smell? Okay, now I'm going to go out on a small limb here and say that I've had a cold, and so my, I may not trust. <laughs> but this smells, um, I want to say, like like a summer beer. This, I smell pineapple, heavy pineapple, yeah, actually. Yeah, a, a lot of citrus, like some mango, pineapple. I'm smelling malt. Okay. I, I am getting, um, to be honest with you, it smells like the bottom of the fresh pineapple that's cored at Meyer. Right. That, like it yep. smells like fresh, real, not canned. Um, I don't smell. I don't smell too much mango, and I don't smell any other citrus. Right. You know, I yeah. don't smell orange it's or lemon. It's almost like the tropical fruits. I just smell pineapple. Okay, but you. But I don't smell malts or anything else. Yeah, I, don't I smell, smell like a malty thing. Okay, okay. let's taste. So, Brad, I like it. You do? Mm -hmm. oh. This is very light, very much a tropical, refreshing summer beer. That is not a flamingo on the can, <laughs> now that I'm looking at this. It's a bird. So sorry <laughs> to these people. This is why I don't. Man, the reviews most of the time. Um, very, very. I'm getting a, a, a pineapple aftertaste though. Like my mouth tastes like. Um, I don't. I don't want to say pineapple. It tastes. I don't know. Like a bad pineapple. Yeah, it's it's not a good it's not a good aftertaste, <laughs> but. Um, this, okay, I'm going to, again, be a girl here, but I would have, like, some grilled Hawaiian chicken and drink, drink that, that 
by the pool. It's that's it, good for the summer. It's very light mm-hmm. up front. I'm not getting anything like the front of the tongue, front really? of the palate, like nothing in the back. It's almost like at f- at first drink I was thinking sour tart. Oh. And no. now it's almost like tropical old. Like it's not it's not a fresh like pineapple or mango. It's like a older one to me. Well, this it's, is packaged on 7, 15, 16. So let's hope that maybe Gills <laughs> is uh, fresh with there. But, well, I yeah, like it. it it's, I, like I it. think it's okay. It's an okay beer, but if you don't like tropical, and I'm going to say older tropical fruit in back. How is someone supposed to pick a beer based on old pineapple? I'm looking for an old pineapple taste. Well, you wouldn't think that. This, okay, a typical beer shelf life is how long? It depends on what it is. Okay. You know, it could be, I would think on this one, six months probably. Well, we're right a few minutes after that. Yeah. But, see, I don't think it tastes old. I think it tastes like a, I think it tastes pineapple. I'm not getting, um, I'm not getting a long... Um, like nasty aftertaste or anything. Um, I actually, I would actually like to have tasted more mango, to be honest with you. Yeah, I, I think the pineapple does stick out with a tiny bit of mango, but there, again, to me, there's something in the very back that's like old or it's malt and something that's rolling over there. The aftertaste is almost gone. I am, I do have some lingering pineapple back there yeah but it's but i but it's not bitter no. it's not sour um i don't think it ta- it's not heavy at all no. it's i it's light and refreshing and maybe i'll go back down and check the rest of the other cans and see if they're all packaged in july <laughs> and if they're not maybe i'll buy another one and i would probably buy it again maybe it's almost like a pineapple rind oh there you go you know kind of tartness mm-hmm. back there okay so what would you give and, us? Well, being not a pineapple fan, you don't care for that. That's not. That's not the right pineapple. You just want pineapple. Yeah. Just a real pineapple. Yeah. Um, I would give it. I think a four out of five. Actually, yeah. I do like it, and okay. I would drink it again. And and if we ever went there, I would probably want to try it out of the tap. But you know, it's me, and it's a girly beer, and it's yeah. light and fruity like me. So. I would probably have to go with a three out of five. Okay. I think it's it's a good beer, but it's not the best. Well, you weren't like, oh, right. it was no the juicy first tree. first drink, yeah. <laughs> that's why I got a one. But the, it, the first drink, almost, I'm sure my face usually I... looks like what yours does when you have an IPA. Okay. But, yeah, I want a little bit more up front, and I want that rininess or whatever that is in the back to go away. So, have you guys had this beer? If so, leave a comment down below. Tell us what you guys thought about it. Don't forget to share and subscribe if you haven't. And until next time, I'm Brad. I'm Jessica. Happy brewing.